current situation, we use an IT mainframe environment. Uh, and we use uh, Focus. Focus is a software that extracts some reports and uh, detects all exceptions. Uh, actually, Focus uh, generates TXT files and then uh, detects all exceptions. And, th and these exceptions are detected five days after they occur. And the problem is that the process does not integrate with the whole client position. And uh, our auditors have to, 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 to search and analyze every client position. And it takes a long time to do this. And then we want to, to change this way, the, the way to, to do the auditing, the way to, to, to make continuous audit. We want to be more uh, efficient, faster in this process. Uh, let me show the proposed situation. Uh, in the proposed situation, uh, we will use data mart and data warehouse IT environment. Uh, and then we, we reduce the time and uh, the time and, and, and the number of false positives in our routines in, in the continuous audit process. Uh, and together, with the data mart and data warehouse, we will use cross-reference and key performance indicators that will uh, detect all exceptions. And then we want to reduce the time to five days, from five days to one day to detect, to detect exceptions in this kind of environment. And I told that we will use cross-reference. Let me, let me give an example of the cross-reference in this project. Uh, on the side, we have a credit system, renegotiation system, and mortgage system. On the other side, we have behavior score system, investment system, current account system. And then, uh, the data from these systems will cross, will be crossed, uh, coming up the net balance of the client. And here, uh, it's, very, it's very important to say that if the net balance of the client is negative, maybe you have a problem. Imagine uh, in our branch, we have today we have 106, 1,600 branches, and then if you have a, a, a negative balance of the clients, uh, we will send an email to the branch general manager, and the branch general manager will have four, 48 hours to answer us and to answer how, uh, how, how will be the action plan and how to solve the problem in that branch. Uh, together with uh, cross references we will we work uh, with key performance indicators uh, and key performance indicators uh, will serve a base as a base to the to the plan to the next period of the audit uh, and key performance indicators for example here uh, imagine it in a branch uh, I, I will talk about the uh, a product uh, about uh, overdrafts and then, if you have access, uh, if if you have a access index higher than clean portfolio in, in a specific branch, maybe you have a problem in that branch, because the number of the the amount of the access is higher, so uh, it's higher than the clean portfolio. So maybe you have a problem, and then uh, we we will send an auditor in that branch to see what is happening in that branch. And then, in this case, the key performance indicator will serve to prioritize the work of the auditor, to prioritize the plan, uh, the audit plan, in this case. Uh, and key performance indicators will show exactly where and when the exception occur. And this is it's very important to say, and after IBM you will talk about this, but uh, it's very important to say that we, you, you use a cube vision in this process. I mean, I'm, I'm, a multi-dimensional vision uh, with a, a, a specific tools to, to have an a, a, index 